Hey, Mr. Freeman. I had a bunch of messages for you, but we had a system crash about 20 minutes ago, and I'm still trying to find my files. Just one of those days, I guess. They were having some problems down in the test chamber, too, but I think that's all straightened out. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you got into your hazard suit. Yes, this all looks normal. Why do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties? I wonder if I should run that test again. That's odd. Perfectly acceptable, you know. Someone has hidden my glasses again. Right on through, sir. Looks like you're in the barrel today. are still not Completely wrong. We just sent the sample down to the test chamber. We've boosted the anti-mass spectrometer to 105%. Bit of a gamble, but we need the extra resolution. The administrator is very concerned that we get a conclusive analysis of today's sample. I gather they went to some lengths to get it. They're waiting for you, Gordon. In the test chamber. Critical. What the hell is going on with our equipment? It wasn't meant to be in the first place. We'll be deviating a bit from standard analysis as procedures today, Gordon. Yes, but with good reason. This is a rare opportunity for us. This is the purest sample we've seen yet. And, potentially, the most unstable. 
Now, now, if you follow standard insertion procedures, everything will be fine. I don't know how, how you can say that, although I will admit that the possibility of a resonance cascade scenario is extremely un... Gordon doesn't need to hear all this. He's a highly trained professional. We've assured the administrator that nothing will go wrong. Ah, yes, you're right. Gordon, we have complete confidence in you. Well, go ahead. Let's let him in now. It's not. It's, it's not. It's not. 